Hey guys, hey Flosstube, it's Jules. Time for another weekly update. I still don't have the framing done behind me. Uh, I meant to do it, I just keep forgetting. I've forgotten a lot of things this week. I forgot to go to get more floss. That's not good. Uh, so I didn't get uh, Old World Map 2 done. I got some progress, but I didn't get it done because uh, I'm still missing some colors, but I still want to go through everything, um, and I will go everything, uh, go through everything tomorrow, I think. Uh, but I got some stuff about my, my plans for the coming week, because I got some changes coming, I think. Um, but this week is all about what have I gotten done, and I got done a lot. This is probably the best week of stitching that I've had in quite a while. Um, worked on some things that I hadn't been working on and um, pulled out some other things that I want to get more stuff done on. So, uh, and the goal is, is even this week to, to do even more. So I don't want to get into like, again, I don't want to get into my plans, but um, we're going to show some stuff what we've been doing. What day is today? What day is today? May 30th. So we're almost at the end of May. For all you crazies who've been doing Stitch Mania, hats off to you. Uh, I... Um, that was not in the cards for me this this year, and uh, I'm not sure if it'll ever be in the cards because uh, I can't really quite be as crazy as you guys are with that. I got my own level of crazy. I haven't seen this in forever. Where did this come from? It's suddenly on the desk here. It is like Fargo's old leash, I think? I'm not sure. Somehow it just suddenly ended up on the desk here. I don't know. Um, all right, so I'm going to show you um, Rainy Water Place because that's what we did this past week. Um, it's what we did on the uh, stitch with me. So I made some good progress on it, as you guys would know if you were watching. Um, so I did I got some pretty good, got some pretty good progress done. So you can actually start to see it's starting to like there's a bit of a shadow of a building that's showing up like right here, which is pretty cool because I couldn't see that until just now. So. Um, it's looking pretty good. I like the way it's looking, so I kept it in the, the hoop because got so much more to do. But we're going to work on that. That is going to be awesome. Put that over there for now. Um, I want to show you a little bit, a little bit of the Reaper. Um, I actually also have, right? Whoa, that's what this is going to look like. So I have an issue. But let me show you first what I'm doing. I'm like, well, what's the page? Oh, okay, so this is the first page. So this is page one, right? And so I got all this to do and whatnot, and so I haven't been doing very much on it because this, I took this with me to, or on the cruise, and when I got back, I, I wanted to start working on it. I can't find the color chart, the, the floss chart. It's only like about this big. So if you guys see it, let me know. But it's only about this big, and... Um, I don't think it got thrown away as part of the purge, the the urinary purge that happened in, in my house. Um, I don't think it got thrown out. Um, I think I would have seen it. I hope I would have seen it. But I need to uh, I needed to kind of dig through some more stuff because I can't find it. And while I did do some more, I filled in some more along here. Um, we're getting down to a point down here where I don't have um, I don't have a clue as to what color that I need. So. Uh, I gotta find that before I can make any more progress on this, which was a little sad because I was really ready to just jump right in and 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 just continue working. Um, but instead, I did this. Whoops! I did this. Do you know what this is? It's the dachshund piece from Gecko Rouge. Uh, I don't have the po the picture with me right now, but you notice that it seems like it's off the grid pattern. Well, I did the grid pattern and then didn't realize that it actually starts kind of off. It's sort of off grid. It doesn't start like right on a right on a uh, like a run on a zero or a ten or whatever. It actually starts on the pattern like off of that. So um, there's a lot of this color to do in this first section. So I've got I got a lot that I can work on this, but it's not very big. It's, I mean, it's quite small-ish as compared to uh, my normal stuff, but I'm looking forward to it because it's going to be really colorful. So we're going to see what that turns out like. All right, what else we got? Oh, I did some more on E Pluribus Unum. Yay! I was really excited about this. I felt like, I, I think I just worked on it for a couple of hours, but I felt like I made some good progress. So as and let's just revisit the idea that I don't know how to center my pieces. I'm terrible at that. So I started way too close to the end here. 
But if you remember, I got, I was like up here, so I got like, let me make sure, let me make sure that I'm right about that. So I got like, I finished this up, came all the way down here, finished this, came across here, and then put in the P and the L, and then this design, and then even that design. I think that was there before, yeah, that was there before. So I just kind of did like this chunk in a couple of hours. So I was pretty pleased about that. This is definitely one of those that I want to get done here this year. So I'm just going to keep punching ahead on it. So I'm super excited about it. Whoa, okay. Um, let's see, that's going to be a to-do. Boba Fett. So I got some work done on Boba Fett. I worked on it a little bit early in the week and then I looked, worked on it a little bit last night too. Um, I need to get colors for it and I kept meaning to go to like, I can go to Hobby Lobby or Michael's around here and I tried to go like three times this week and each time I forgot uh, my, I have this like, this like little wallet that I carry around and uh, forgetting it at home every time, every time. It's not, it's not good. I've had some serious lapses this week with that, but um, but anyway, I st I even stopped. I was getting ready to go in the store, and I'm like, I don't have anything to pay with. I can't do this, and so I'm hoping that on Friday that I'll get to do that. And so anyway, so I'm making a little bit of progress. So a little bit more of Boba Fett's heads coming in here. You see, it's not a very big pattern, but when you pull it back, you can actually see a little bit more, but. So I just filled in a bit more, but I still got like little bits, little single individual colors to fill in to give it more nuance. But that's that's as far as I've gotten on that one. Uh, I did not work on baseball this week, but I will show you what I got done on Apothecary Shop. And I gotta say, if you've got really stiff ada out there that you don't you know that you're just like man it's you know it's too stiff man just soak it in water because after i soaked um after you know this is part of the the accident the dog accident part um after i had to clean it and i soaked it in you know hot water for a while and whatnot um two things happened one it got super soft so it's like it's super soft now so it's really nice to work with but i didn't even think about this i went to start working on it the other day and uh, when I soaked it, it washed off all my, all my grid lines. And I was like, oh, no, that's not good. And it, um, I'm trying to remember if this one had, like, the natural grid lines on it. I think it does. But I got to tell you, if it did, kind of, that also kind of washed out a little bit with the, with the water as well. I'm not 100% sure on that, but I'm thinking it might have. But let's show you what I did. So I got, I mean, this chunk down here is what I got done. I got a little bit of color right there. But I really just filled in all this down here. Um, this is sort of the, where's that picture? All my, all my stuff is torn. It's just all mess. All right, here we go. So it is, where are we? So it's below this. So it's like this part down here. The door of the cab is what I'm working on right now. So, so it's this. Oh, so it's kind of filling in a little bit, but a lot of a lot of dark colors right there. So I'm really enjoying it. Let's try and focus that a little bit. I don't know if that worked or not, but um, so anyway, so I got a nice big chunk done in here. So I still need to go back in and fill in a few more things, but um, that. Whoa, what happened to my light? Hold on, I feel like I got dark. There we go. Is that better? I actually, okay, so I got a new camera. I'll tell you about that in a minute, or camera. I got a new phone is what I got. So, all right, so I didn't do anything on the baseball piece, so I'm not gonna show that again. Um, let's see, bag two. Where's Ronnie Rowe? Where's Ronnie Rowe? All right, Ronnie Rowe. I took it out of the uh, the hoop. I need to move it a little bit, but got a bit more done. Gosh, it always seems like I feel like I get more done than I see, but I did get like this part, which looks like a window or a door or something. Um, so, oh, can you see it all? I think I can see through the thing. So, yep, just making progress. Making progress. So, yep, just kind of going across. Going across here, you can see actually this is the house. So you can see like 
how it's going to be super concentrated through here. And then once I get that part done, it's going to be a, it's going to be a lot less, I think, and uh, it'll go a lot faster. And that's another 2018 finish to be. Um, all right, now I think I might only have Old World Map Two. And you're gonna be like, it doesn't look any different from last week. But I'm telling you, I filled some a couple other colors in. I don't know, it may not look any different, but it's getting close. See how close it's getting? So I just gotta fill some stuff in. Whoa. Whoa. So just a lot of missing colors here and there. And these are the ones where I can't find the colors right now. But honestly, if I go through everything that I have, I might have these colors here somewhere. I'm so, so, so disorganized with everything, especially after what the dogs did. Um, but there's that, and then here's this. All right. So my updates are going kind of quickly right now, and I'm okay with that because right now we've got hockey getting ready to start in like five minutes, and guys, it's the Stanley Cup Finals, and I gotta watch. I mean, it's the Capitals and the Golden Knights, and it's game one was great. The playoffs have been great. I am like super excited about this, so we're gonna we're gonna watch some hockey tonight, some hockey. Um, but let me put this here. Stay. Uh, but to address this issue that I'm having with my floss, so quite a few of you guys made suggestions about how to better organize and do this and that and whatnot, and I take all those into account, and I'm all like, that all sounds great doing this and this and this, but the bottom line is I'm messy. I'm a messy person. You should see this desk right now. There's like six projects strewn across it. It is a mess. And where I keep my stuff downstairs is a mess because I tend to um, I tend to sit down at times and I'm like, okay, let me grab this project and work on it. And I may work on it for a little bit. And then I'll get up with the intent to come back and sit down and work on it. And then something else happens. I end up not coming back. Uh, and when you have... We have very busy, pretty busy lives, and you have seven dogs, and all these things are going on, and and I'm clearly forgetful as well. I'm just not good at keeping myself organized in a neat way. So I um so I'm messy. I'm sorry, but that's just how I am right now. That being said, I'm gonna try something different, and this is something that I've been thinking about for a while. So I've showed you guys before how I have I don't have anything with me, but I have like my project boxes, which are like my floss boxes that I keep everything you know organized in and what I'm going to endeavor to do is try something a bit different uh, going forward and I don't have it I actually just came this afternoon but I didn't unbox it to show you guys but um, I'm hoping that well I know that by the next video it'll be up and I'll be using it and we'll see how it works but it's basically just like a like a organizational system of it's just the little um, plastic trays plastic box trays kind of thing that you could see in somebody's garage or some of you guys may have it as a way to organize different things that you may have. So there's like a, a metal thing that kind of attaches to the wall and then you just hook the boxes onto it. So what I plan on doing is just basically organizing my colors, you know, by number, you know, all the way across, you know, do like, you know, up to one, you know, up to 200 or something and then go 200 to 300 and, you know, stuff like that. And, um, so I got to figure out how I want to do that. But I figure if I do that, I can get all my colors easily up off the table, um, easily findable, uh, in these little individual, instead of having to pull this thing out and this thing out and this thing out, trying to find my colors. Um, I'm hoping it's going to help me keep neater and more organized so I can find things faster and that I can stitch faster. That's the goal. Faster stitching, right? So that'll be something that hopefully we get done here in the next couple of days. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be so awesome. And so I'll have that next, uh, I'll probably shoot a little video with it and include that with next week's video. And um, so that's, you know, I'm definitely, I'm super looking forward to that. I should also have a bunch more floss um, to go. My husband keeps saying, hey, let's make a trip over to Stitching Shop this weekend. And, and I'm like, yeah, we could do that. And then I'm like, oh, man, I've got so much to do, like in sense of stitching, you know. So I'm like, I don't have anything new that I need to get just yet. I'm getting seriously close to 2,000 subscribers. And I want to thank you guys for that so much. Thank you for all my new folks that have uh, started watching me. I appreciate that so much. I seriously, like, I, 
you know, I get inspired by your comments and your questions and the progress that I continue to make just keeps pushing me forward. And I'm able to do all these things because you guys watch. If you guys didn't watch, I don't, I, you know, I would definitely do all these projects, but I would, would I do them all at once? Probably not. I'd probably go back to the doing one project at a time and maybe, I don't know. I might, I might have changed forever in terms of how I stitch, but, um, but anyway, it's just, it, it's just awesome. So the husband is like, so you're going to, you're going to do some, you're going to get something new, aren't you? Or you're going to do something new. And I'm like, I'm not getting anything new. I have so many things that I haven't even started yet. Um, so, but would I add in a new project? First of all, I need to finish this one, which I finally was able to track down. Do you guys remember this one? Dogs drool. Dogs leave uh, paw prints on our hearts and, and then the bottom and drool everywhere else. And so, um, so I've tracked this down. I've tracked down the pattern. Um, I think I have the colors, but now that I have all this, I can actually start making some progress on it. So I want to finish this. Um, I want to finish, um, I really like to finish Ronnie Rowe. And I'd like to finish, you know, maybe one other thing before I start something new. I'm dying to start the, um, uh, oh man, the one in New York City. Um, the really abstract art looking one that I cannot remember what it's called right now. I also want to do Rainy Day in Boston. Um, absolutely want to do that one. Um, I, I, I've got the Yoda piece. I've got the, the hearts with the flowers. I've got, I mean, I've got like a ton of things that I can do. And, um, so the idea of starting something new, I'm just, <sighs> no, I gotta finish. We must finish, right? I really want some finishes. So I need to make some serious progress and I am like super motivated now to do it. It is awesome. I am super motivated. I'm super excited about it. I, uh, so my plans for this week, we're going to get the, um, we're going to get the new cross stitch stuff organized, cleaner, hopefully more manageable and faster progress because of that. Number one, number two, we're going to get the floss, you know, I'm going to go through, I'll be able to go through all my floss, see what I have, see what I don't have, and then go get the floss that I need. That's number two goal. Number three, um, three would be to make some serious prog progress on the dog's drool. Um, four would be to find the color chart for Reaper. And barring not being able to find that, maybe by maybe the uh, kind makers of this pattern maybe give me the floss chart? Maybe? Maybe? Um, so... We'll see. Uh, so that's, and that's that. And so then it's just, otherwise it's just the stitching. And I want to throw in like Stormtrooper. Cause see, I still got Stormtrooper uh, that I got to work on. Um, work on baseball, baseball, right? Um, got to work on baseball. Um, got to try to finish though. I mean, there's so much to do. And I say that in a very happy and excited way. Cause I really, really, really do like it. No, I don't. I love it. I love it. Uh, last thing I want to tell you. Oh, okay. Wait, I got a couple things. Um, we lost two hives, um, this past week and well, we technically, we probably lost them before now. Obviously we lost them before now. Uh, queen's just not taking and, um, going off or something happening and the hives just are not gonna, they're not going to succeed at least at this point. We're, we're just going to wait until next year. Um, put a brand new group of bees in there with a new queen and we'll just start those off fresh. We still have, I think, five solid hives. Um, we didn't really put a video up this week. My husband was kind of so disheartened uh, at uh, finding the the two hives that weren't that weren't going to survive that uh, he just he shot a video, but it's he just didn't want me to, to put it up because it's not a very it's not a very happy video. So um, so that happened, but that's going to be okay. We're gonna we're still you know we're still pushing through. We're still learning. I mean, we're only a few years into this, so we're still learning. Um, second thing is we saw Solo this past week. And um, I'm not sure if I talked about going, because I think we went on Sunday morning. No, Monday morning. We went on Monday morning. And uh, we really liked it. You know, I, honestly, we walked in with very low expectations. And, you know, just we'd heard some things about it you know, not being good and just they had all these issues when they were filming it and whatnot. 
and just general impressions were that we really enjoyed it. I think that if you're more of an old school Star Wars fan, you'll like it more. And, um, you know, set by itself, it's not a, you know, it's not necessarily a super exciting story and different, you know, I don't know. It really depends on how you look at it. But we really enjoyed a lot of the, the small touches that they did, little homages to different parts of Star Wars and Empire Strikes Back that were really good. And, uh, yeah, it was just, it was really enjoyable. So we had a really good time with that. And that being said, I think I need to go watch some hockey and upload this video. Oh yeah, and I did get a new camera, um, or camera, I say it again. We'll see how good the quality is on this one because I've not, this will be my first video I've shot with it, but it's a new phone and, um, we're, uh, and we're experimenting. And I still need to get myself a new stand because the old stand died. And so I mean, I f totally forgot about needing a new stand. Uh, I think I broke it on Sunday when I was trying to shoot the video. But um, anyway, so other than that, we're all good. I'm going to get to stitching. You guys get to stitching. Let's all stitch together. And I'll see you this weekend for a stitch with me or a stitch along, whatever it is. And I don't know what we're going to do. I don't know. I really don't know what we're going to do. We'll figure it out. Maybe we'll do something new. Who knows? Maybe we'll do something new. All right. I'll catch you guys later. Have a great stitchy week. Take care.